one thing we know that protects the body and brain is trying to avoid blood sugar spikes. So when people get cardiovascular disease, type 2 diabetes, so when you're looking at the hemoglobin A1C, for example, the common um, indicator of type 2 diabetes, this is really an indicator of how often you've had blood sugar spikes in the previous couple of months uh, prior to the blood test. And those um, blood sugar spikes then lead to, as I think uh, Mary was alluding to, vessel damage. And, um, you know, many people um, uh, feel that that is a very important contributor to uh, cognitive decline um, and uh, perhaps dementia processes as we age. So it is important to avoid those big blood sugar spikes, which the types of diets that have been shown to be helpful are diets that don't have high amounts of processed sugars and big glucose loads or sugar loads um, at any one time.